Hi guys, I'm Sasha. Thanks for joining me. Today I want to show you uh, how I made some stocking hangers. So the first thing, the most important thing, is that it is weighted. That was my first challenge. Um, I came up with the brick idea. I got those for 90 cents at Home Depot. Um, you could probably get them at any hardware store. And then just an individual hook um, that I attached. And then you can cover it with just about anything. Scrapbook paper, fabric, felt, wrapping paper. Uh, you could use floral stuff on there. This is a Christmas village piece that I had. You could do toys, picture frames. You could switch out the picture every year. Um, so, you know, it, as far as the basics, just putting the hook onto the brick, that's the part um, that was the hard part to figure out actually, is how to get a small uh, thing for the hook that was heavy enough to hold the stocking. So once you've got the brick and the hook, you can get really creative. So check out how I did it. Maybe it'll give you some ideas. And again, I'd love to see your guys' pictures of your projects and things you've been doing. And uh, stick around and let me know what you think. So here I have my brick. My glue gun has been heating up. And the first thing I'm going to do is the bottom. And I pre-cut my piece of felt. And I also pre-cut my sides. All right, I pre-cut my last piece to wrap around the back, the front, and the top. going around the edges now and I trimmed off a little bit of extra that I had and now I'm just making sure that all of these edges have just a little bit of glue so they can really be closed at those edges. All right, so now I'm gonna trim off the extra here and glue this final bit down. I will have to make a little slit in there with my scissors.
This is a bear I got at Walmart for $2.98. And just going to start attaching him. I found some of these hanging around. These are um, really cheap ornaments. I think I got these at the dollar store. You get like six for a dollar. I'm going to give this little bear This one I just wrapped like a present, but I have to cover this area here. So I cut a little felt circle with a notch in it. I'm just gonna slide this over the hook and glue it to cover up that spot there. So this is a picture frame that I got at the dollar store, and these are some old metal ornaments. And I'm going to go ahead and put these on the frame, on the front, and then you'll still be able to slide the picture in here. Well, I hope you found that inspirational. Please send me pictures of things that you're creating, um, especially if this gave you any, any ideas. I'd love to see how yours turned out. Uh, don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you next time.